The Spectrum VoIP mobile app is a companion soft phone for Spectrum VoIP's Stratus customers. The Spectrum VoIP mobile app is available for both iOS and Android devices. In this video, we will be going over the iOS version. However, the basic features are the same no matter which device you use. When logging into the app, you will use the same username and password as the Stratus web portal. If you don't know your login name or password, tap on the Forgot Login Name or Forgot Password button or contact your administrator. To place a phone call, tap on the Dial Pad button to bring up the Dial Pad. Enter in the destination you would like to reach and press the Send button. You can dial internal extension numbers as well as external phone numbers. When using the Spectrum VoIP mobile app, calls will be placed using your Spectrum VoIP caller ID number. By default, the Spectrum VoIP mobile app is designed to ring at the same time as your desk phone. Inbound calls can be answered by tapping on the pop-up indicator on your device. You may need to ensure that your device's notifications are enabled for the Spectrum VoIP mobile app in order for these notifications to appear. During a call, you will have many similar options as a traditional desk phone, including putting the caller on hold, muting the caller, and putting the call on speaker. You can also transfer the call or create a three-way call by pressing the Add Call button. The Switch Phone button will allow you to move your phone call to any of your other currently registered devices. The Contacts tab shows a list of all of your internal contacts along with contacts from your mobile phone. For your company contacts, a red phone indicates the user is currently unavailable or on a call. A green phone indicates that the user is currently not on a call. A gray phone indicates the user has a phone but is currently offline. Tapping on a contact's name will bring up their information. To call the contact, tap on the phone icon. Additionally, you can add the contact to your favorites list by tapping on the star button. To send a text message to the contact, tap the message button. You can also send an email to the contact if their email address has been added. The Voicemail tab allows users to listen to and view their voicemails. To listen to a voicemail, navigate to the folder where the voicemail is located. Then tap on the message you want to hear and press the play button. You can also forward the voicemail message to another user. Or press the phone icon to give them a call back. Tapping on the trash can icon will move the message to the trash folder. The trash folder is emptied automatically overnight. To save a message to the saved folder, press the Save icon. The Information icon will let you view more details about the call. The Chat and SMS tab allows you to access your chat and SMS messages from your mobile phone. To resume a chat, simply tap on the conversation. To start a new chat, tap the pencil tool. Search for the contact you'd like to chat with, or enter a phone number if you have SMS enabled on a number for your user. The Call History tab contains a complete history for your user. Tap on the Information icon to find out more information about the call, or give a call back, or view their contact information. In the More tab, users are able to adjust the priority order of their answering rules, edit and record new voicemail greetings, and change other general settings. This includes mobile data use. Adding your cell phone number will enable your mobile phone to function as an option for outbound calls. For more guides and tips, head over to support.spectrumvoip.com. And as always, thank you for being a Spectrum VoIP customer.